today I'm going to show you on how to clean your silver using the monosodium glutamate. This is the first time I'm going to use this and also this is the first time on YouTube using this uh, method of cleaning. These silver chains are very tarnished so I'll try this method. I'm using the aluminum plate same as uh, cleaning using with baking soda we have to use aluminum foil or this time we're using aluminum plate we just put a small amount of water to uh, make the silver wet then this is monosodium glutamate as you can see it's Ajinomoto uh, Ajinomoto did not pay me for this <laughs> so just like uh, when you're cooking and using this uh, MSG tak 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 like that it costs only 3, three pieces So no need to worry about uh, chemical because this is not harmful chemical because uh, this is actually used in cooking. These silver chains were found under water. These were found at the sea while metal depicting and they are very earnest. it with a toothbrush there are different methods in cleaning the silver but I want to try this one. I just got an idea, an idea from my brother when I gave him a silver chain. I told him that uh, just clean the silver because he is tarnishing over time. And he told me that uh, he had tried. Uh, monosodium glutamate in cleaning silver so this time I'll try this for the first time uh, let us see the result so while brushing I can already see that uh, it's cleaning up and it's already shiny also so that uh, I can clean the inner parts uh, within the joints
sun cream it's already shiny and you see that spark but even if you are always cleaning the silver it will tarnish over time due to daily use because of the acid in your skin you sweating yes, acid. and I have noticed that uh, the two these two chains that I, I have soaked and not yet pressed but uh, they are already shiny so meaning even the silver is tarnished you, uh, you just soak the water we monosodium glutamate after around five minutes it's really clean no need to brush no need to do anything but brushing is only a way to remove the loose dirt so now I have confirmed that this monosodium glutamate is uh, very effective in cleaning tarnished silver As I experience, this is more effective than cleaning through baking soda. Baking soda, you need uh, hot water, but this only using warm water. Can you see that? It's very clean, it's shiny like new. So to avoid tarnishing, you you can have this electroplated silver plate so that it will not tarnish again but over times the plate they remove that is the reason why the silver is tarnishing so I am happy for the result of this using this for only one piece I already cleaned my silver chains beautifully And try this if you have MSG at home. Actually, we're not we're not using MSG in cooking. Uh, yes, both one for this. Uh, I also have a video on how to clean gold and how to polish after cleaning. So I'll put a link here that uh, you can also try you can leave comments if you are not subscribed yet you can subscribe and click the bell button so that you will be notified every time I upload a video my channel is variety channel so whatever uh, whatever I think helpful or interesting I just make video and upload so the channel category is variety channels are about mostly about metal detecting motor motorbikes how to whatever so thank you for watching see you in the next video By the way, this is the way how I polish gold and silver. I'm just using the cotton cloth. I don't use any polishing compound because it's a homemade video. So as you can see, my silver is uh, spark sparkling. It's very nice and lovely. Polishing like this, make sure that uh, your chain is intact so you will not break, you will not break your chain.